Hi, I'm Jesse Stay at GeekGreens.com. Today I've got a really cool little uh, insect here. This is uh, called a parasitic wasp. It's a little scary sounding, but these things will actually help your garden and will not sting you. In fact, you'll never even notice they're in your garden. They're so small. Um, and what these do is, if I pull them out of the package here, I got these from Amazon. Uh, you can find the link down below in the comment in the description. Um, but uh, inside here, if you can focus in here just a little bit, inside here are these little, um, inside here are these little um, moth eggs, uh, and they all have a little parasitic wasp egg inside. And what happens is the parasitic wasp lays eggs inside uh, these uh, moth eggs, uh, and the parasitic wasps hatch out of their eggs, eat the the moths out of their their eggs and uh, and then go and continue the cycle so eventually you have no little worms or other bugs in your garden and they're very effective in that so we're gonna put these on a couple of our trees and uh, see how they go so uh, so right now we're gonna take um, one of each of these and we'll put them on a tree around the garden so let's go okay so right here we've got in this little container. Again, I just got this off of Amazon uh, to do a search for parasitic wasp. There's actually a scientific name which I'll include in the description um, uh, and the link should be be down uh, down below. Um, but anyway, if you uh, if you uh, take this and uh, just open it up, what it, this is one of my this is my apricot tree and I've got a little uh, got a little pin right here. And all I'm gonna do is attach this to my apricot tree with my little pin here. And I wanna do it at least a little bit tight so it doesn't come off. And uh, if you look right here, on here, this little piece of tape or whatever it is right here, um, they call them cards, um, uh, all these are little teeny microscopic uh, moth eggs and inside the moth eggs are little uh, parasitic wasp eggs. Uh, now that sounds scary, a parasitic wasp actually is smaller than you will even be able to see pretty much. Uh, I think if you looked up close you could probably see them but uh, uh, they don't fly much, they, uh, uh, they don't sting um, and really uh, they uh, all they do is they find these these insect eggs and insert their own eggs in, and then the young uh, uh, the, the the young uh, that hatch from their own eggs uh, go out and they eat the the eggs of the host, um, and then they hatch. So in here, these are all going to hatch in the next few days with new parasitic wasps, which will then go and do their thing. And I'm putting this on my fruit tree here because I keep finding grubs in my uh, fruit. And I'm, my hope is that these will eventually control the grubs and other worms. Uh, these will go around my yard and all over. I mean, here they're very successful. So we're going to, to uh, try these out and hopefully they, they turn out pretty successful. But uh, they're parasitic wasp eggs. They come in these little containers with these little cards on them. Uh, and uh, and really, they uh, uh, that's that's about that's about it. These things will hatch in the next few days, um, and you can uh, you can buy these right on Amazon. I'll include the link down below. So we're doing this in the dark tonight uh, because uh, it's good to do this in the evening. It actually, I could have done it uh, when there's still a little bit more light out. Uh, actually, had some other stuff going on tonight, so I couldn't uh, do it. Um, uh, but uh, uh, that's why you see the light in me doing this in the dark. Um, but it's still good to do this later in the evening when it's cooler because they respond better in that, in that case. But, um, so I'm going around my yard here. We just did it in the tree. And, uh, um, and, uh, and uh, so, so I'm just kind of putting them, I've got three of these that I'm gonna put throughout the yard. And this one's in my vegetable garden. So uh, you can see I've got some little, some bugs have been eating here. Um, uh, there might be something on the bottom here. No, uh, something's been eating here. These uh, these parasitic wasps should uh, should attack some of these things. That I've got flies flying all around me here. That they'll they'll attack the fly eggs and other things like that. So we're gonna take the second one here. 
All I do is open it, take it out of its pouch. I've got my little safety pins here that I'm using. You can also tape them, um, or if you can keep them from blowing away, you can put them somewhere uh, in, in the cup even. Um, but I'm going to just uh, do it right here. Get my pin, put it in nice and tight if I can. Blow away. And uh, ideally, if I can have it just pushing against the wood, that would be the ideal situation. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get all the way in on this wood. Um, that ought to do though. It's, it's not going to come off very easily. Um, and just let it hang there. These will hatch, uh, these will hatch pretty soon. Um, but that's, uh, that's the gist of it. The next one, uh, the next one I'm going to, uh, put in another part of my yard. Um, and, uh, I think that's going to be about, uh, all I need to do. And hopefully these all hatch and we'll start eating the bugs and the worms and, uh, the bad insects in my yard. They're actually really good insects, these parasitic wasps. The order them down on Amazon down below is jessystay of geekgreens.com.